For 25 years, neither rain, nor sleet, nor dark of night has stayed this courier from his appointed rounds. His life consists of sidewalks and stairs, doorbells and housewives. His name is Bill Pohl. Hi, it's your Fuller Brush Man. I have a free sample for you. May I step in? Thank you. Some people seem to think that the Fuller Brush Man went out with the Iceman, but we found out it's just not so. Bill Pohl, for example, is still pounding the pavement in Buffalo and Tonawanda after 25 years. And he makes a pretty good living hustling from house to house. The Fuller Brush business began 66 years ago, when old man Fuller started making one model of brush in his basement and peddling it door to door. Today, there's a line of up to 300 items. They're not all crammed into Bill's little bag, but they include everything from the basic brush to fancy cosmetics. Bill's not a foot in the door sort of guy, so he gets a certain number of doors in the face. But even in this age of tight security, Bill still gets a considerable measure of satisfaction from brushing up his business. Don't you find that the public is a little more suspicious of strange men who walk up to their door with little cases in their hand? They might be, but when they say they're a fuller brush man, why, any resistant melts away, and it's uh, easy going from there. They are paying more attention to the merchandise than they are to the individual. They know what they want, and they purchase it from us. Well, we just thought... Oh. Well, we just thought you'd like to know that in this age of suspicious people and double locks, the great American tradition of the Fuller Brush Man is still alive and selling. As Bill puts it, Fuller Brush is a name that opens doors. So now let's try another name. This is Henry Lawrence, eyewitness...